some people are talking about how much Linux was better, so I'm downloading it on a slow FTP server because uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm downloading it from a slow FTP server and I'm going to put this on my G4. What will happen next? Who knows? Time to insert my Kubuntu PowerPC 10.10 .10 CD I burnt into the G4. Let's turn on the NIP and and the devices I'm going to try to get working are a printer, the keyboard and mouse, all the hardware built in, and yet still be able to actually use it. Will it work? That's the question. That's why I needed to set up that annoying chime doesn't come on. Can you have to shut it? Let me hold down option or window key. Oh my god! Piece of crap, Mac. Well, actually, I'm holding on the wrong key. Macs are so confusing. Good. Let's see if this junk will actually work. Oh, Linux CD. PowerPC Linux has a custom bootloader, and it's a lot different than Intel Linux. Ooh, loading RAM disk. Black screen. Sorry, I accidentally hit one of the buttons, but now it's time to boot in. This is actually working. Holy crap. Now, this isn't going to work. This card is. So, I'm going to hook up. the old Linksys. No, I'll just hit USA, USA. 
the Windows keyboard, and as we all know, Windows keyboards work better with Linux, unlike Apple keyboards. Same with the two-button mouse. You're going to need a two-button mouse to use Linux correctly on a Mac. And if you have one of those crappy one-button mouse or Apple keyboards, throw them out the window and smash them. Because Apple's keyboards and mice, well, the mice, not their keyboards, but only the layouts suck. But the mice suck. See it's Power PC Linux booting from WLAN zero. I'm gonna test this. Ooh, I plugged this in. And so far, I'm already having issues. Hell yeah, network configuration failed. Do not configure at this time. Probably configure it when it boots. Now, I already have a Leopard CD on an OS 9 disk. So... Guiding... Um, use entire disk. Yeah, I don't care if I trash my OS 9 partition, I'll just reinstall it a day later. 40 gig max or I ripped out of a compact. Yes, I'm going to destroy my hard drive. Pow! Now I'm going to pause it and wait until something interesting happens because it's going to take a while, probably. So I'm back after like an hour and it's installed. No. Oh. Mm. Installation is complete. Let the fail begin. Well, not really fail, just boot up. Still. Hey, it's actually booting. So far, one error message.
because it looks like it's working, I'm going to let it sit for a minute or two. Well, looks like there's been a freeze up. Maybe your video card's causing a freeze up. I don't know. Let me try a reset. That fails, I always can install S10. I'm gonna zap the PRAM after this. Well, zapping didn't work, so I'll just have to power the thing off. Pokemon. Gonna, oh, this actually is working. Or is it too yellow, too red? I mean, too white. Let's do but not much. Crap. 